setup. So small window of opportunity for the French side. Oh, very quick jump there into the connector. Tarek has made his way very close. Is he going to try and be flashed through? Could be uh, an opportunity from a teammate if they need it. It's ready and waiting. Going to make the jump over and spot nobody. Bit of a one-two punch setup going on over at Long, though. Maybe they can make that work. Kenny's in the back while Shox is up front. So if Kenny misses the shot, Shox can swing wide and try and get the kill anyway. But flashbangs can ruin this. And there's one right in the eyes. And Shox can't see anything. The bike not going to save him either. Skadoodle goes down. And Kenny almost getting caught on the light post there. Very dangerous. Another grenade, and he has to fall back. So good setup, but those flashbangs from Cloud9 are so good. Yeah, they, they've got, I mean, we, we've brought it up a number of times. Utility usage for Cloud9 is phenomenal in these games so far. Still, Kenny, you can see you have to admire it. Still going back for the fight, still knowing he's got to do more for his team. Readjusting over towards the B bomb site. This is just NBK. He's all alone. Thankfully, there's only going to be one angle to this attack. No one coming up towards Sandbag, so he'll be able to survive if he can isolate these properly. When does the flashbang come in? Do they do it or are they just going for contact? There's the shadow, there's the shot. NBK not able to get the second, not able to get the follow-up. And Body doesn't want to push into the side. He knows it's all on this round. Stewie, he hears it. Apex stepping a little bit too soon. Now Body in so much trouble, but Kenny's going to be up the high ground getting the kill. He almost went down himself. There's Body picking it up, and now it's a one versus one. Stewie versus Kenny, the smell of gunfire and freedom in the air, and Stewie picking up that kill, and Cloud9 are in the semi-finals. Oh my god, what a story, they shut down G2 almost flawlessly. I think everyone's shocked the level just brought out by Cloud9. We all hoped, we all wanted to dream, I don't think anyone believed it would happen in this fashion. Start to finish of Mirage, start to finish of Overpass. They had an answer for everything, Anders. G2 could do absolutely nothing. They have come such a long way to this moment. You're watching history live here, all the way into the semifinals for the American team. What a terrific turnaround for them. I think this is the third time we've had a North American team in the semifinals of a major. It could be Liquid at Cologne. It'd be MLG Columbus. Tarek was there with yes. CLG. Yeah, that was a bit of an outlier all on its own. So it doesn't happen very often. And obviously excitement all around here. And you could understand why Skadoodle there all the way on the left. And we, are, we do have Sue with Tarek down on the stage. We're going to hear from the winners. Thank you very much, guys. Congratulations, Tarek. Cloud9 take down G2. But more importantly, in front of your home crowd here in Boston, you have made the semifinal of a major for the very first time. Wow, it's, it's an amazing feeling. I want to say firstly, thank you to the crowd. You guys are all great. You guys pushed us to the ends. Uh, you guys motivated us. So thank you all for showing up here. I appreciate that. And uh, props to my teammates. We all played insane. It was a beautiful series by us. Uh, I'm really proud of everyone. You guys definitely looked so confident throughout that entire series, 2-0. The last time you played G2, it was a loss, and back then you said G2 just read you very well. So what was different this time? Uh, I think we adjusted really well, and we had a good game plan going into the game. But on top of that, we were very confident, and we had a lot of momentum from the first map, and we came into the second swinging. Um, I think we all just played great, uh, but I still want to give props to G2. I think they're an amazing team, very dangerous team. So uh, just a great game overall. Well, Automatic told me that your goal now is to win the major. So if you're going to do that, you need to take down your next opponent, which is either going to be SK, who the last time you played them, you beat them at IM Oakland, or Fnatic, who you have not played this new roster yet. So what do you think of those opponents? Uh, it's going to be a tough match, but Cloud9 will win the major. This is our major right here. Last but not least, Tarek, I heard that your family is actually in the audience cheering for you. So. You said something to your fans already. Now words to your family. Uh, yeah, I love my family, obviously. Thank you guys for coming out. You guys are great. This gives me the extra push. Round of applause for them for coming out to Boston. I appreciate it, guys. Congratulations again, Tarek. Best of luck in the semifinal match. And now it is time to head to a short break. But when we come back, it's time to break down the series at the Analyst Desk.